Well, my friends, here we are uh, one day before opening of Romeo and Juliet. We've been practicing a few weeks now. I believe about three weeks. I missed an entire week just because I was working at another campus and we weren't running through my precise scenes. Uh, I, as you see, I have an earbud in because I'm still practicing my scenes. Uh, this is the first production I've ever taken part of and it's absolutely amazing what these kids do. It, it blows my mind. They have memories <laughs> so much better than mine. I've got this little pittance of lines in the entire play playing Lord Montague and I'm, I'm still panicked for my lines. Uh, I, I don't know what I'm going to do, um, but uh, we are practicing tonight. Uh, this is called Tech Week where we have all the, the stuff set out. Mrs. Sullivan, the director, has been working like crazy. Um, and the full cast is here and we're doing you know four hours a night tomorrow during what's called our access period we're going to be uh, doing two act two tiny bits of the, the scene to kind of get everybody pumped up uh, two two parts of the play I should say to get everybody worked up so that uh, they'll want to come and see the play we're doing the sorts and um, but there's Juliet back in the background uh, running her lines uh, I mean, this is, I, I just don't know how people do this as a profession. Um, I don't know how these kids can be so dedicated to it. I mean, we have people back in the wings ready to, to you know, move sets and, and they're just running. It's unbelievable the dedication that these kids are putting in. Uh, the flu has been going around. And so we have two of our cast members uh, who currently have the flu and are practicing um, you see, I mean, parents have their kids here, you know, be, because they're so dedicated to, to being in the place. I should say staff slash parents have their kids here because, you know, they, they got to do the play. They got to watch their kids. And uh, everybody is so completely dedicated to this performance that it totally blows my mind. If we could do this in other parts of education and other projects, uh, I, I mean, the educational system would, would just be totally changed if we had this kind of dedication uh, in other public school systems like we have here in this system. Uh, I, I'm blown away, frightened to death, but uh, it's going to happen regardless of whether I'm scared or not. Yeah, 48-year-old teacher, I'm scared. I'm scared of flubbing my lines in front of everybody. But we're doing great, and we're dedicated. And there's the director right there giving more direction. So until next time, have a nice night.